like that on special occasions in Victorian England. I wasn't there. Anyway, let's go back to Paul and John and find out more about poor William Huskisson. He was a dignitary. Apparently he was on the outs with the Duke of Wellington and went to the railroad opening, tried to curry favor with the Duke, got pushed in the way of a train, lost a limb, didn't go real well. Actually, from what I was reading about that, apparently the rest of that opening didn't go all that well either because the Duke got, got pelted with garbage. <laughs> now, I don't know. I'm thinking maybe with American military heroes, I don't know, maybe it worked a little bit better. I was, I was just thinking about Eisenhower and Wellington. You know, we had I like Ike. I don't know. Did they have, like, I rebuke the Duke? Um, yeah, they had the the Duke is well formed in, you know, classic 18, you know, 1810 and kind of liked it when everybody understood their position and when he became prime minister and nobody was in positions and class structures were changing as a result of industrialization he went wait 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 i liked it when those rabble knew their position yeah he was he, he was not good for rabble was he coming up mr levy's first five question set all that and more in the next segment of It's Not Trivial to Me.